Okay, this here is a beautiful California classic. It's a 1974 Cadillac Eldorado convertible. Um, it's in great condition. I'm gonna go ahead and do a once around type thing here and show you a big overall picture of the body and all. And then I'll go up close and show you any little minor blemishes or anything that I see on it. Um, as far as classics go, muscle cars and things of that nature, um, it don't get no nicer. It, it just doesn't. Um, there's no rust on it. Um, it's had a new paint, well, I don't want to say new. I did though. Um, it's got a newer paint job. It doesn't look to be more than six, eight months old the most. Looks like it was in some kind of a parade from the um, paperwork we've seen in it. Um, newer top, newer interior. Um, it's in great condition. I'm gonna go up and show you anything I see on it. There's a little rock chip here. This here it looks a little more bigger chip. Ding. So chip there. Chip. Scratch. Chip. 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 That's the most of the chips. Gash? Gink? Gink. That's a gink. Um, on the trim, along here you can see, I hope, that they um, probably didn't take it off when they painted it. And they got just a little bit of over sprayage along the edges. Can't see it on the face of the chrome or anything. Um, down the side, as clean as can be. Um, still got the factory skirts on it. And um, top is in great condition. I want to show you this. It looks like it's faded or something, but it just got some dust on it there. Nothing there. Um, top is in great condition and tight as can be. With the um, window, not at all faded or nothing. Um, great condition. Like I say, these things here usually rot it out, but this one ain't. Little slice there. Nothing bad or anything. These are in great shape. Going down this side. Oh, it's missing a hubcap. Door ding. Right there. Um, this piece of chrome trim here is separated. And that is, oh, you know what? Got a leak in the valve stem there. I'm gonna have to. I'll get that fixed. It won't have a leaky valve stem. But that brings up something good about this car. These Vogues are like new. Little titties all over them. Um, you can see, just like new. I don't know how long ago they were put on. Couldn't have been long. Um, no, the chrome, beautiful shape, no rust. Um, little gash right there. I got all my own little words. Gash, gink, gank. Um, that piece hanging out there from bottom of the door you might have seen in the beginning. I'll show you here, this this. It's the um, rubberized trim. Fell off that little piece from that little hole there in that piece, and it's separated. So whatever needs to be done on that, truthfully, at some point, put new weather stripping. New carpet in it. Pedals are in great shape. As far as the seats are concerned, like I say, beautiful. Front and back. Back doesn't even look like no one's been set in it. Nice and squeaky. Um, your climate control, the blower motor don't blow. Um, oil pressure gauge and temperature gauge aftermarket. 37721 showing on it. I'm gonna go ahead and fire it up for you. Fires right off, it runs great. Little thing here works fine. It's got the maintenance schedule. The emissions information, the warranty information, the original owner's manual with the original parchment paper thing inside. It's separated from the booklet cover, I guess you'd say. But other than that, it's in great shape. <clears throat> Bunch of Best Buy receipts and such. Um, it was, it had a deck put in it and some stuff like that. Uh, let me see. about it. Um, what is this? Mobile electronics installation. And to bring that up, I want to show you. 
it back there. It's a Pioneer deck. I pulled it out to see if I if it was hooked up. It's all hooked up, but I don't have the face. I put it back in upside down there, as you can see. Um, dash has a few cracks in it, like there. Other than that, it's in great shape. Um, I want to make sure and um, show you in a trunk here. Hyphonics 12 inch woofers, performance technique amp, and a crunch amp. Inside here is beautiful. This cardboard with the carpet over it, factory has um, kind of gave way. And you can see there, there's no rust in it. Um, the floorboards, beautiful. Got the original tar paper, tar baby stuff there. It's just as nice as can be. Um, we didn't clean it up much or anything. I just kind of... I've been driving it around. Pictured it just now and the automatic motor works. Shouldn't have shut that so hard. Um, I didn't show you in this side here. Floor being there. I don't know if you've seen that when I went around it. They did the door panels over when they did everything. Other lights work, but this one don't come on when you open the door. It's just as nice as can be. I'm gonna go ahead and, um, uh, let me see how I do this. I'll pop the hood from over here. Yeah, big car, man, you can, oh, I wanted to show you this. 60-40 split bench seat. I'm going to the other side, this is just TMI here, too much information. Okay, 60-40 bench seat, and it all works, all electric. Um, every position, front, forward, up, down. As far as the top goes, I do not have, have not had the hydraulics working. And it doesn't seem to like, want to go back like that. Um, I have not messed with it much. I'm going to try right now a little bit. I know it works. It's not going to be a one-man job if you do it, but it's totally functional and it totally works. It just um, is not a one-man job, and that's what I am right now. Um, so I'll leave that all to you, but it would definitely go down with two people easily. I'm going to go ahead and relatch the top, of which it latches fine and everything. Like I say, it's all functional, just in need of two people. I wish I had had Samantha or Matt come down with me where I could do this for you, but I didn't. My time's almost up. I've got a minute and 15 seconds. Give me a call on this car. My name's Nathan. You can reach me anytime at 406-544-6919. Check out my website, serialmarshmallows.com. Click on blog and you can see any of the newer stuff I have for sale right now. Clean as can be under the hood. 500, 500 cubic inch motor. And I know you're a long ways away and I just want you to be able to see all this up close and in person. Not a leaky mess or nothing. AC compressor's on there. Um, go ahead and give me a call at time. Name's Nathan, 406-544-6919. Check out my site, SerialMarshmallows.com. Click on blog there and you can see the other cars. And make sure and subscribe to my videos and check out some other videos. I've got lots of old classic and Euro cars on here. And thank you very much for watching.